That's why you shouldn't marry a divorced woman. Guys, listen. You have no idea how much fun I'm having now. How much fun I'm having, right? But I could have saved my, my ass all that pain and heartache, right? If I would have just done what God told me to do in the first place, right? If I just did what God told me to do in the first place, bruh, I would have been, I would have been chilling. But watch this. To the glory of God, right? Now I'm dating the most beautiful women. I'm chilling in my penthouse. You know what I'm saying? I am chilling, having fun, meeting new women, new prospects, right? But I didn't have to go through the pain that I went through. You know what I'm saying? No, I'm, I'm quite, I'm quite over it. <laughs> Shit, I'm, I'm good now, right? But when you're going through it, man, you're going through it, man, right? You didn't want to be left alone, man. There were, there were days where, man, I didn't get out of bed, man. Right, a day or two, man. I when 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 all this shit um, balloon, man. I, day or two, man. I didn't get out of bed, man. I was just sleeping in bed, man. Just just hoping the pain would go away. Listen, guys, that pain is gonna last till that pain goes. I say it again. That pain is gonna last until that pain goes. Until it gets, until it's done with your ass. For some, for me, it took about three, four months. For some people, it takes years. For some people, it's never, and they delete themselves. So you really gotta be careful. Right, what you're doing out here because divorced women sometimes could.